guys, I am Jamie Adcock, also known as the Running Diva Mom. I'm a running coach and personal trainer for women with a boutique fitness studio located in the Madison, Wisconsin area. Today I'm going to demonstrate a core and arm exercise. It's also going to work your shoulders and your back. It's called the quadruped alternating row. I'm just going to grab a set of three five or eight pound dumbbells and go down to the mat. So let's join me on the mat here. We're going to go on all fours, one bell in each hand. Hands are underneath the shoulders. So line those shoulders up right over the hands and the bells, nice and wide. Knees are wide, right underneath the hips here. So you're going to look straight down. Knees are right under the hips. Square the hips up with the mat. Our hips aren't going to move. We're going to bring the right arm up. Elbow comes back, glides across your body, and then point up towards the ceiling. But if you watch me do um, form on my own here, my hips aren't going to move. They're squared up with the mat. So we're going to square the hips up with the mat. Pretend there's two dots on the mat beneath your hips, and you want them to point to those dots at all times. So we're just going to alternate. Glide that right elbow across your body. Bring the elbow up. Squeeze the shoulder blades and come back down. Square the hips up. Other side, left elbow glides up, elbow pointed up, squeeze the shoulder blade, come back down. A lot of people tend to bring their hands out in front or out to the side when they return. Make sure they come right back underneath those shoulders. Make sure that the knees aren't moving as well as the hips. I'd suggest doing 10 to 15 of these on both sides. You can repeat all on one side or you can alternate as I've already demonstrated. Neck relax, breathing in between those bells on the mat. So that's a demonstration of the quadruped alternating row. Thanks so much for joining me and have an amazing workout.